Hello everybody, my name is Storm here, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 After the End. In the last episode, we launched a war over here for the region of Shasta Cascade, and we took that fairly easily, no big deal there. I went ahead and actually handed out the counties to new vassals, so that's all taken care of. We can't take the duchy level title because the guy who holds it is still in the middle of a war with somebody else or something, so we'll have to wait. And we do have an, a rebellion over here that we're going to be dealing with in a moment. We're moving forces into position to take care of that. Um, also, we had one of our rivals, which is actually a vassal of one of our vassals, manage to successfully kidnap us, and so we are now in that guy's dungeon. So, we are dealing with that, and because that guy is our rival, he will not accept ransom, and we'll just have to wait until that he decides whatever it is he's going to do with us, and hopefully we'll be out of there soon, but we're just going to continue to proceed on uh, as needed. Uh, we do have some threat, we're up to 50%, so I'll we'll have to deal with that, no problem. And uh, continue to clean up this area here in the west. Take the last little bits here. So, oh, also, I want to mention that if my voice gets a little uh, froggy or groggy, um, I apologize for that because I'm still dealing with the really nasty cold bug that uh, hit me like a truck couple of days ago and um, caused me to delay the release of this episode so uh, hopefully everything will be okay I am feeling better um, but not a hundred percent yet certainly all right let's unpause it let's get this thing rolling all right that guy's my regent he's not as good as a regent as I had before Can I not, like, appoint my own regent? One thing I can do is enforce realm peace now that the council's been empowered. Apparently, no, I cannot. I have no control over who my own regent is while I'm in jail. Alright. That's fine. Ursulines. Alright, let's load up. Commanders. And launch my attack. Apparently I need a new marshal. We have another dangerous faction. Beautiful. You. Train some troops for me, please. Thank you. that independence faction again. Uh, we won the battle. Crushed the enemy. Very good. Offer peace. Enforce demands. Right, let's move these guys back. Let's see... Where would be the best place to sit them? Uh, come all the way down here, actually. Regency has ended. Guards rouse you from your slumber, and you are dragged from your cell. Your high fabricator, Justin, has decided to release you, but not before you have spent some time in the stocks. Discourages the youth from causing trouble. I, I, this is weird. Uh, one guard mumbles, oh, and I expect rotten tomatoes. Uh, 
Everyone deserves respect and I'll give it to them. I gained the humble trait. Alright. Well, that's definitely not the worst thing that could have happened. Definitely not the worst thing that has happened. Alright. Someone who's a dynastic... ...member. Well... ...who's of our dynasty and has good opinion. Uh, Carolina's back. I think that's who I just assigned to be regent. Is this retinue? Yep, that is retinue. You know what? I'll keep it. And you have a long march ahead of you to get up with the rest of the retinue. Uh, Carolina? Let's see... Not you. Oof. Oof. What about you? I guess that's as good as it's going to get, right? Publicly humiliated. Minus 25. Really? Recent passing of your kinswoman, Adela, you are perfectly positioned to assume control over banking assets. Yep, yeah, we'll take the banking assets. What do we need? We need a chancellor. You're not that good of a chancellor, but we are going to appoint you chancellor to get your opinion up because you're one of my more powerful vassals. Prince Lawrence of the Valley and Georgiana Steinbach, my kinswoman. Sure. Need a new regent. Someone who's dynastic. Ah, uh, well, doesn't look like there's anyone, so you'll have to do. Court dwarf. Oh, we actually have someone who can be court dwarf. Cup bear. Champion. Master Blade, Venerable Elders, and a Commander, you. I throw a little money around. guy a little bit. Annalise has finished her education diplomacy. She is masterful. Great eminence. Very good. Alright, so... You are still in this war. Offer to join your war? Apparently not. So we'll just have to wait for that guy to finish his war normally. Uh, apparently, I got 40 gold. Okay. One thing I could do is hold a grand tournament, though they are quite annoying at this point. My daughter, Prince of Quebec. We'll accept that. Princess Anne, conscientious, playful, and willful. We'll go with martial education. Uh, just the other day, skulking as I often do, I caught oligarch Harley the Fourth of the Quad Cities of my courtier Virginia in flagrante. 
It didn't notice me, but I am still in shock. She's a married woman by the machine spirits. Uh, you. You are... Really don't like me. Let's uh, expose the affair. Does that give me a reason to imprison? No, it does not. Alright, where are we at? 38%? Really shouldn't matter much. Mary's the heir to the tycoonship of Jersey. We'll accept that. Eighty-three and a half percent. Is there anything I can do? This guy, this woman is a bit of a problem. My spy master? Can I appoint a new spy master? Actually, yes, I can. Hopefully that won't cause me any problems. Now, is there anybody here I can try to improve relations with? Maybe you? Yep, needs a new ship, we'll buy a new ship. They're kind of a stinky... Diplomat, but uh, we'll see how you can do. Petty noble from Nipissus has spent a week visiting Cayuga, constantly bragging about his wealth and his estates back home, and insulting his local peers and behaving like royalty. Your courtiers are quite sick of him and are asking you to take action. We will write a formal complaint to the tycoon of Quebec. Dear Prime Provocator Justin, I hope that this person is not causing too much trouble. I will inform my people of your customs so the misunderstandings can be avoided when they visit your realm. Thank you for offering a chance to correct this behavior. All is well. Very good. Vassals can be discouraged from associating with conspiratorial factions. Obligate the vassal, please. And uh, she has promised to leave factions. Good. And that has crippled the factions. Who's next? You are next. Oh, I can't move it until October 23rd. I'm starting to think Earl might fancy me. Nope. Righteous imprisonment. He's the leader of a plot. And he will not end his plot. Young Chelsea has finished education in ways of war. As evidence she's excelled in her studies. Good. Betrothed can marry. Send her off. Very good. Now you. What are we to do with you? Let's 
see. I think that if I send you here, I then get a better chance to imprison. Is he involved in any plots? Governor Bentley the second. Not plots, uh, factions. He is. Attempt to imprison him. Alright, he's raised his flag in rebellion. Alright, so let's see what we can do. How many troops does he have? 53,000 troops. They're scattered about at the moment. Raise Carolina's troops. Raise Florida's troops. Raise Louisiana's troops. Raise Magnolia's troops. I think we can do this. Alright, so you guys. March on in. Victory. Are we leading troops? We don't want to be leading troops. We absolutely do not want to be leading troops. As increase, there are many things we do different in future battles. We will focus on flanker, I guess. Over vassal limit. How do I have that many vassals? I'll have to check on that. Valley and Holy War for Mother Load. Apparently, that title came back. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. So let's see, you... It's kind of hard to tell what's supposed to be in here, what isn't. Oh, you're minus 100. Yes, we'll go with you, Grant Vice Royalty of the Valley. And then we will fight this holy war. Shouldn't be too hard. Hold on, there's like a big army sitting right there. Alright. Well, we'll just sit our guys there in Siege. Siege of Lagrange. Uh, split the army, send 20,000 troops. So send the 20,000 troops here. I'll make sure that these 20,000 troops have commanders. Because we're going to be involved in a big fight. And it's actually looking like they're going to need reinforcements. Alright. 
Alright, my daughter needs an education. She's brooding, she's conscientious, she's playful. She's a good marshal already. She's also a good... Let's go with Intrigue. My daughter. And... Nope, we're gonna decline that. I've had a trouble... I've had trouble with the vassal of mine and tried everything I could think of to help us get along better. Chancellor Governor's Winthebold managed to do in one day what I struggled with for several weeks when he told me that I just asked the vassal for forgiveness. Yeah, we'll reward him, sure. My daughter, no. Victory, let's see, Siege of Oakland. Ah. Let's march my army in there. Cedic rebels have risen up in San Francisco. Well, I had an army sitting there, so no big deal. Uh, let's make sure you have commanders, at least a couple. Uh, make sure there are no commanders here. So this is over. This title back out. You'll do. Or maybe you? No. Grand Vice Royalty, there we go, do that. Transfer the neighboring counts. Oh, the commander appointed, all right. So here's what we're going to do. These two armies are going to converge. Crush that. Oh, we managed to succeed there. Force demands. Usurp the title Prefecture of Shasta Cascade. Yes. Dijon Kingdoms. Dijor Duchies. She has to cascade. So that actually belongs to you. type of holding in demence. Okay, so this was what they were going for. So, I'm going to grant you that title as well. San Joaquin. There we go. Oh, and this one as well.
I see, is there a whole oligarchy that we don't have? Nope. Dorado. Tahoe. That one. Yep, there we go. That should be everything now. Alright, so this battle is now joined. And Benning. Let's just uh, smash that army as well. march back down here. At least one of those armies. Stay right there. My nephew. Conscientious, affectionate, and playful. Diplomacy, definitely. Alright, how goes... The world of Mountain Lending contains sharks, like you, and the chum that you feast upon. You are the apex predator, your debtors and banking rivals merely exist to be built of their wealth. 72%. The guy defaulted, but again, there really isn't much I can do about that. So, okay, this got cleaned up. Oh, Oh, dude, he took a big chunk of Jefferson. I did not realize that. Yep, and... We're transferring that to the valley. Actually, it shouldn't be being incorporated anymore because it isn't held by Jefferson anymore. Ah, we got an amb ambitious adventurer coming. Oh, and you're trying to siege there. No, 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 let's go like this. Make sure that we take oh, take the commanders out of the sieging army so they're available for my attacking armies. My daughter, Prince of the Maritimes, will accept that. Son, conscientious, haughty, and timid. We'll go with learning. I can usurp the prefecture of Motherlode. Yep, usurp it. And where is that? Is your duchies? Mother load. All right, so then that goes to you. To hand out as you see fit. All right, we won that battle. And actually, I'm thinking I'm probably going to go ahead and end the episode here. We're at just about 30 minutes. Uh, and I need to take a little bit of a break from my voice, so I uh, will finish up this bit here when we come back and then see what else we might be able to grab. It's around 61%, we need to get that below 50. And, uh, 
continue working on things. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.